going on, America? It's your man, Head Crack. It is time for the hip hop spot. How you been? You been all right? You guys got a little taller since I left. So here's what's going on in the world of hip hop. Let's uh, talk about Cat Williams. Yes, his brother's back in the news again. And it's almost like I feel like I'm making this stuff up. But it actually happens. So, Cat Williams was like, I don't know, it's hard to tell, it was a brick building, could have been a project, could have been a school, I don't know what the hell's going on. And he was surrounded by kids, a bunch of people his height. And something happened between point A and point B, and Cat Williams just sucker punches this kid. I think uh, the kid challenged him to a game of basketball. And I guess that's how you're supposed to react when someone challenges you to a game of basketball. I don't know. But anyway, so Cat Williams sucker punches this kid, and this kid puts him in a very respectable, um, Macho Man Randy Savage worthy chokehold has him on the ground rolling around with him. Now, the internet would have you believe that Cat Williams got choked out and put to sleep. Nah, that's not what happened, man. Don't let the internet gas you. He did get, like, you know, choked on the ground, but, you know, they peeled him apart, and then Cat Williams was kind of just, like, you know, like, you know, sitting on the ground and just talking to the people. And, um,. I don't know what the hell's going on here. Why are you sucker punching like 14 and 15 year old kids? Why are you getting, ch why are you hanging out with these people? Where's your security, sir? If Cat Williams had nine lives, you have four left, bro. You're having a rough 2016. We gotta move better, man. About to get spayed and neutered, bro. Easy does it on that one. In other hip hop news, uh, let's talk about Fife Dog from a Tribe Called Quest. Now, uh, for those people who know anything about me and my particular sophisticated taste in rapping music, not just hip hop, but rapping music, um, big Tribe Called Quest fan. Fife Dog uh, was a member of a Tribe Called Quest, a group that consisted of four people, Q-Tip, Ali Shaheed, Muhammad, Jerobi, and Fife. He passed away last night at the age of 45. People are saying it's due to renal disease, which is uh, complications of diabetes. And to that I will say, everybody out there, we gotta start taking care of, it, uh, of ourselves. Uh, what you fail to realize is, the game right now is population control. There's way too many people walking on the planet right now. FDA is approving all these different foods and they're just letting you have them. You got some countries that won't let people have certain things because there's too much sugar in it or it's just not good for you. Shout out to England. You guys are really good about policing what people do over there. Um, here in America, we just kind of go for it, man. We shovel pounds and pounds and pounds of sugar in our, in, our, in our system and heavy carbs and, you know what I'm saying, our portions are large and everybody's walking around here effed up, man. So, with that being said, man, you gotta go to the doctor, take care of yourself, watch what you eat, drink more water. Now, this I ain't trying to be all preachy or whatnot. This is supposed to be celebrating Fife, but I think if Fife was here, that's what he would want you guys to know. Maybe he would have wanted somebody to tell him that early in the game, so maybe he didn't drink all those Mountain Dews and, you know, put himself in a hospital. But, uh, you know, that aside, he contributed so much to not just his group, but to hip-hop culture as a whole. I mean, this is like certain Tribe Called Quest lyrics As soon as you hear the first line, you know what time it is. Yo, microphone check one, two, what is this? The five-foot assassin with the roughneck business. Who starts a record off like that? Fife Dog started a record off like that. 1989, I strictly slid into place. Buddy, 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 all up in your face. Once again, Fife Dog. Bo knows this, Bo knows that, but Bo don't know Jack, cause Bo can't rap. In that same long, in that same song, he said, I'll bust a nut inside your eye to show you where I come from. Smart man rap. Shout out to you, Fife Dog from a tribe called Quest. May not only you rest in peace, but you rest in power. And the situations that you went through to put you in the situation that you're in currently, may that inspire and educate those so we can move better, man. It's not about, it's not about losing people. It's about what you learn from the people you lost. We learned a lot from you, Fife. Rest in peace, brother. That's the hip-hop spot. I'm out. Shout out to Cat Williams, too.